Like many, I've always wanted to fly. Through the clouds, above the trees, over the seas, and beyond. But I think this desire ultimately stems from wanting to just feel free. Free to maneuver through life in any direction. Free to live a life of possibilities. And free to truly be me. I believe it is this yearning to fly freely that has always attracted me to the arts. Because when I am in a creative flow, no rules exist and no problem can stand in my way. When I hold a pen in my hand, it is like a magic wand. And a blank canvas feels like an open sky. Often I don't even know what I'm going to make when I start creating. I just let my feelings and the spirit of imagination fly through my hands and into the artwork. This feeling of creative freedom is so phenomenal that it is something I have grown to nurture, protect, share, and apply to every area of my life. So whether I'm taking out the trash, cooking some tasty grub up in the kitchen, or just shooting hoops, I integrate my creative spirit into everything that I do. I see my existence as one comprehensive work of art. So even though I may specialize in drawing, I don't consider myself an illustrator. I'm just me, and I like to create with whatever is available. Because to me, art is making something out of anything. A testament to this fusion of art and life that I embrace is my coffee table style book titled The Art of Life. I designed, edited, and self-published this collection of my poetry, photography, writings, drawings, and paintings in an effort to further liberate myself and share my art with others. It took an immense amount of patience and tenacity to create this book, but my proven ability to come up with creative ideas and solutions has given me the confidence that I really can do anything. I've ran through fire, I've biked 100 kilometers in a day, and I've even jumped out of an airplane. So it's not a stretch to say that I have actually already learned to fly and I live to help others do the same. That means sometimes I might be out in the streets protesting for freedoms and a better world. And other times you may see me selling my works of art as a nonprofit artist that donates 100% of all earnings to various charities. This motivation to uplift others is what has led me to become Mr. Brian, the art teacher. Teaching art is more than just a career for me. It is an extension of my creative energy. Rather than working with a pad and a pen, my medium is the human mind and spirit, and I love that. Developing lesson plans that engage and inspire students is a fulfilling challenge for me. I find joy in building relationships with students as I guide and support them through their growth. I strive to make my classroom a welcoming space where everyone can learn, work, have fun, and feel safe enough to take risks. También, cuando sea necesario, Puedo hablar en español para enseñar arte a los estudiantes hispanos. In an effort to create a reliable sense of peace and community, I will always do my best to model respect, responsibility, and compassion in the classroom. Our study of art will lead us throughout history, from ancient times and classical artists to the diverse scope of the modern art scene. Through contemporary and innovative methods, I will teach students to express themselves and explore their unique ideas. At times, students will be encouraged to work together so they can understand how everyone's unique ideas can contribute to something larger. While art will always remain the focus, my curriculum will be dynamic and integrate technology, math, literacy, science, and more. <laughs> Lessons will help students reach state standards and also develop their creative thinking skills. I know many of my students may not go on to pursue careers in art, but they will always need the ability to think creatively. Because of this, activities will be intentionally designed to spark creative thought and it will guide students along the creative process so they can learn how to generate new perspectives and ideas. With this creative skill set and artistic knowledge, my students will develop the confidence to navigate through life's challenges. And ultimately, I hope the students will learn to think like artists so that instead of limitations, they can see possibilities. And together, we'll be able to fly freely through any storm and above any cloud.